Hello and welcome to the new Power BI tutorial video and in this video I want to show you how you can basically remove the rank from these main categories or basically which is at the uh, total level. So total is basically for this furniture category or office right. So because it is not adding any value if you see it's always 1, 1, 1 and 1 right. And if you remember I have shown you in my previous uh, video as to what they are and this is at the table level rank and this is at the subsection level rank that means rank for its own section as you have three sections first second and third. So with that let me show you how we can remove this particular piece because what we are doing is we are creating a rank which is only at the subcategory level in this case which is for the entire table. So I'm coming on to the second table and I'm what I'm going to do is uh, I'll just come over here var underscore sub category rank is equals to this right and then I will press alt enter. So what I have done is I have moved this particular rank into the um, into the uh, you know in a variable. So I'm creating another variable. In this case, I will create a result variable or underscore result as I usually go with uh, just to say separate it from the rest of the other fields. Okay, so we are saying if is in scope, right? So now with the help of in scope function, what we want to say is if we are in the scope of a particular dimension, well, in this case, subcategory, right? Then only show this, otherwise, don't show this. So what we are saying is we need to show the underscore subcategory rank and close this and alt enter we need to say return underscore result and press enter all right so as soon as we do that if you will see the rank is now gone right we are only showing the rank for the subcategories which makes sense in this case same way you can do a practice for the second formula which i have shown you to produce the rank at the subcategory level and uh, that way this is not adding any value okay so if that's what you need you have it in front of you and now i'll meet you in the next video with a new topic and just one quick information which i forgot to uh, tell you is basically my google sheet you know which i basically keep it this link i keep it in the description so that you can come and view all of my 300 plus video in an easy to search manner and find the video and jump onto that video using the video link. Similarly, if you need data set, the link is present in description and I am using the data set which is this particular one sample superstore in the data, which is in the data set sheet of the data set folder. So this is the data set sheet. All right. I wanted to just give you this information in case you want to replicate these results. With that, thank you so much. Meet you in the next video with a new topic.